Hi. Hello. Welcome. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Carly and on this channel I like to talk about books and stuff and life. Um, and today, um, filming this really, control really quickly because, bless you, um, because I am about to leave and take myself on a little date, book shopping, pop subly some food, and a nice drive date. <laughs> uh, it was my birthday a couple days ago and I kind of want to treat myself to some books so I'm thinking of going to like my favorite bookstore that I don't visit nearly as much as I should um and just seeing what is there there's a couple books I do maybe want to pick up but we'll we'll see I might treat myself a little bit more than I usually do when I go to a bookstore I thought I would take you guys along so let's head on out It is Sunday. Happy Easter. Uh, if you celebrate it, I don't really, I kind of forget it. it's Easter every year, but it's Easter. And it is absolutely gorgeous out today. It's supposed to get cloudy a little bit later, um, but right now it is. I don't see a single cloud. Bright blue skies, sunny. Ugh, it feels like spring is finally here, um, but I think it's still cold. Anyway, I thought we would continue this little like weekend book acquisition <laughs> vlog by going out and dropping off some of my books at the little libraries that I want to get away from my unhaul video a couple weeks ago, a few videos ago. I've got this huge box full of books that I want to get rid of. Um, I'm not going to take all of them with me. We are going to exchange some stuff out and I've got some new changes. I think I've decided I'm going to keep Aristotle and Dante. I think I'm going to give this one more chance. We're going to reread it at some point this year. But a little um, sneak peek into what I bought. I've talked about it many times before, but um, the Founders Trilogy is my favorite trilogy. I needed to own all the books. So for Christmas, I asked for the books that I didn't have in the trilogy, which I think was just the horse too. I gave my mom an Amazon wish list, and I could not find the cover of Foundry Side that I wanted. So I got this cover. Well, yesterday I went out and bought this cover. This is the cover one. It matches the other covers of the other two books that I have, and I just like this one a lot more than this one. So we're keeping Aristotle and Dante, and we are getting rid of this cover. What books do I want to bring? Mwah. Alright, so I've got a pile of books, possibly, um, yeah, and I want to, it's, I realized that a lot of this right now is pretty popular, I would say, like VA, VA Schwab's always been kind of popular, maybe she's not as popular as she was when I heard these, but I still think it's popular, I definitely know A Court of Thrones or Roses is very popular, I know they had the movie for Red Ride and Royal Blue, and I still feel like that's pretty popular, not sure about Station Eleven, but I still feel like that's pretty popular. And I also have Upside Down, but The Seven Husbands of Evan Hugo, which I know Taylor Jenkins Reads is still very popular, as well as Babel, which is another very popular book right now. Um, but here's kind of thing is, this is a little tote bag. Can I fit this in there? I don't know that I can fit these in there, but I guess what I'll be doing is stopping my car. I want to take all these. Oh, I want to get rid of these books, but like it's so hard to get rid of books, even though I do not want to keep these. Oh my gosh. Okay. Let's, let's do this. Let's do this. We're going a mixture of, I wanted to be a little more kid friendly, but also adult. When I'm looking at this, I don't know how kid friendly a lot of this stuff. Some of this might be a little more younger. Um, if only because I know I'm going to be by some churches and some schools and yeah, okay. <laughs> Books. 
taupe this big um it doesn't break and that um i can maybe get rid of some of these most of these all right i'm feeling nervous i'm feeling anxious because i've never done this before and like i feel like i'm doing something wrong and it's gonna look weird that i'm parking in front of houses and that like i'm not going to the houses they don't know me but it, i i can literally park in front of these houses okay i just need to stop this is this is the anxiety speaking and we're still gonna go do this okay we're gonna go do this let me put some shoes on grab a jacket and um my purse and we will go this one is so cute i never stopped at it what do we got in here What is that? Is that one of the um, Outlander series? This? I don't know what this is, but it's pretty. Amish Widow. Then, looks like a bunch of kids' books, which is a little understandable. Errant King. Nora Roberts. Ooh, that is covered in mold. Oh, Spider Wit Chronicles. I used to love this book as a kid. I know this is not the actual book, but that is a bit of a throwback for me. Okay, we're gonna give um, these four books. Here's hoping they go to new homes. All right, not a whole lot in here, but these are the two that I am dropping off in here for now. All right, it's a cute one. A little hard to open, come on. Come on, there we go. How many? Let's <laughs> do. Not a whole lot of options. We're going to drop off three. All right. Bye bye, books. Have a good life. Oh, cute. Let's do this. Oh, I already see one that I would like. Okay. Wow. I might bring more. Anyway, uh, these are the three books I am gonna drop off here. I think they'll fit in, but this one, never gonna pay full price for this, never ever. I actually don't think I'm gonna like it very much, but I've heard talk about it and I've been wanting it, um, so. I've been curious about it. I shouldn't say wanting it. Curious, so we're gonna do it. What's this? Pictures of Huckleberry Finn. Oh, wow, wait. No, I know what this one is. I read another one by this author, and I wasn't a huge fan of it. Um, that's another cool one to see, but I don't think I'm going to take it, because I am not interested. I've not seen a lot of contemporary ones on this little search, so seeing some contemporary ones is pretty cool. All right, bye-bye books. I hope you have a good, good life. Are you confused, Lily? All right. <sighs> Hands washed, water drunk. Let's do this. Just got back from trying to find little libraries around. Um, that wasn't too helpful. There was like a couple I was trying to find, but like they don't exist anymore. Like I could not find them, um, which is fine. I managed to get rid of all but three of the books I wanted to. We will have to do this again in some other time. Give it a couple months or so, I would say. This bag came back much, much lighter and I'm very happy about that. Let's do a little book haul, weekend book haul, just to show you what I got. Let's round up. So yesterday I went to one of my favorite local bookstores and found, managed to get three books there. And then while I was also at the bookstore, well, 
around that area I found another used bookstore I'll put in some I put, probably put in some clips already which is really cool I've never been in before it was a lot there was a lot of books there were stacks of books like I didn't take a video or picture of it but going down the stairs like stacks of books on the stairs and their shelves going down the stairs it was books books were everywhere it was really cool but like I don't have a lot of patience for that um but it was still really cool would go and check out again but the three books I managed to get, I already showed you one. It was um, this copy of Foundry Side. Um, I just, I love this series. I love this book and I love this cover. Uh, it'll match the other covers that I have and I am very, very, very excited about that. Another one that I picked up and I am so excited about this one is this copy of Emma. This is like the new Puffin classics that just came out for their Jane Austen books and I think they are gorgeous. They are so, this is so pretty to me. This is so cute. Like I just, I, I don't know. It, it's absolutely, absolutely gorgeous. So pretty. Emma was the only one I could find in this cover otherwise I probably would have also picked up Pride and Prejudice and um, I'm looking for a cute cover of Northanger Abbey so if you guys know one please let me know. Anyway I am so happy to have this. I am so excited for this to sit on my shelf to like pick it up and read it when I feel it when I want to and oh, oh my gosh I like I can't stop looking at this. This is so pretty! And then the last one I got while I was at that bookstore is The City We Became by N.K. Jemison. Jemison? Jemison? I should have probably learned that. Um, I've been wanting to read this for a while and I just decided now was finally the time I was going to treat myself and get it and read it. Uh, I read the fifth season by this author and absolutely adored it. Like that series is so good. I sh at some point should get my own copies of it. But um, so I've been wanting to check out something else by this author and this is... I think the next one that I recent more recently came out and I've had my eye on. Sounds interesting. I loved other works by this author. Excited to read it. Um, I also, I don't typically buy books that I haven't like read, I would say, or am unsure if I'm gonna like. And so I kind of wanted to treat myself to a book that like I hadn't read and wasn't 100% sure if I was going to like because sometimes that's a little fun to own some books that even though you're unsure of. But I'm really hoping I like this. Like I said, I loved, loved, loved the season series trilogy. So I'm really hoping I like this one. All right, and then today, um, there wasn't a lot of options with the little library. It was a lot of like mass market paperbacks that were just not my type of thing. I found one book I also showed, I think I should, it was covered in mold. Um, it was the only one that kind of seemed interesting and there was a lot of like Christian stuff which shouldn't be too surprising but again not really my thing. Um, but I did manage to find one book and that I was really excited about um, which is Wayward by Amelia Hart. I've been seeing this book around recently and I'm not gonna lie I don't think I'm really gonna like it <laughs> which is weird that I like got it but it does sound slightly interesting to me and it was free and if I don't like this I'm just gonna go put it back in another library. So I am excited to own this to actually have a physical copy of it. I'll probably get to it around the summer or something. Hopefully I like it more than I think I will. I only say I don't I'm not I don't think I'm gonna like it is because I don't know why it's gonna be flashbacks, flashbacks to this other book I read a couple years ago and it feels in the same vein. And I did not like that book. So here's hoping I like this. Those are all the books. Let's do a little thumbnail. Let me... Mm, why don't we do this? We'll switch things around. Lily! Get that out of the way. Scare my cat. We'll do that. Okay. I know hair's different. I come back to read the film this outro. But that's going to be that video for today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, evening, afternoon, morning, whatever it is. I hope it's good. And I will see you again with another video soon. Bye! Say hi!